What's up everyone? This is Pratik Kohad and these are my marquee memories. I saw Ben Howard at Bowery Ballroom. I think it was 2014. Firstly, I love Bowery Ballroom as a venue. It's a little smaller. I think it's like 500, 600 people. And just seeing Ben Howard there was amazing. He played with a very small setup on that stage, as far as I can remember. Like it was just him, his drummer, and a cellist. So it was super intimate, but at the same time, it sounded incredible, like really big. And I remember being really impressed with that. The drummer was also kind of like playing the bass at the same time while playing drums, which was really super cool. That kind of influenced my. approach to live sets as well like i would always try to find musicians who could do multiple things towards the end of the concert everybody was applauding really hard and i remember him just looking and smiling like almost very shyly and it just came across the really humble in that moment like it felt like he was almost surprised at how the audience was reacting and i just i just remember being like that's that's so cool that was a very memorable moment for me Impala from 2015 at this music festival in Paris called Rock and Sen. I went there with a bunch of my friends from school. There were four of us. That was my first festival experience. I saw a lot of acts, but Team Impala is the one I was most excited for. They just put out their album called Currents that year. There was a song called Eventually which I was just obsessed with at the time. We got there, it was crowded, full of energy. They played the song Eventually. The song Eventually. <laughs> They're a massive sounding band. He always plays with like a lot of cool musicians. I just remember the setup being like really intense and that also comes with its own energy and I feel like I'm always trying to bring that energy on stage as well. This was back in 2013 or 2014 that Hammerstein Ballroom which is again one of my favorite venues in New York. It's a much bigger venue. The sound is very interesting. It's super like spacious. I went for Young the Giant. Amazing set. I remember like being really obsessed with this song called My Body. It's like this really like high energy like pumped up song and it used to be like my running song. I also just remember like waiting for that song My Body till the end and they didn't actually play it till the encore. I kept telling my Girlfriend at the time, they're like, "Man, what's going on? When are they going to play that song?" And then they went off stage, and I was like, "What the hell just happened?" And then they came back and played it, so that was great. Fast forward like five, six years later, and Samir from Young the Giant is like a really good friend of mine now. We heard how it like kind of came full circle like that. Thanks for listening to my Marky memories. Catch me on the Way That Lovers Do tour to make some memories of your own. <laughs>